tyrosine is the precursor to dopamine. And tyrosine is also an aromatic amino acid. All right, talk about dopamine because I know I've heard Parkinson's and dopamine move together. Yeah, so dopamine is absolutely the problem with Parkinson's. They, they're uh, um, inferior and I just, I forget the name of this place in their brain that makes this dopamine, dopamine product. And the uh, it's, it's impaired and it, it, there isn't enough dopamine uh, being made. Uh, being provided in the brain, so it's a dopamine deficiency problem, and so a dopamine deficiency problem can de can be traced directly back to a tyrosine deficiency problem because that's the precursor. And to tyrosine dopamine. is an amino acid. It's an aromatic amino acid, and it's disrupted by. Oh, uh, the aromatics! Those are the ones that are stopped by glyphosate. glyphosate. Yes. And they're normally produced by the gut bacteria. Yes, they're produced by the gut bacteria, and then of course they're also in the food. But of course, if the food's been exposed to glyphosate, then it's going to be right. depleted so, as so well. All right. So, so so the glyphosate eliminates the production both in the gut bacteria of these essential amino acids in the aromatic, uh, in the aromatic section, mm -hmm. and then also in the food itself, it may be bound up and, and unavailable. Mm -hmm. All right. So the, mm -hmm. the tyrosine relates to the dopamine. Okay, that's pretty simple. Any other things about... Yeah, well, in fact, there was... So there has been a study on earthworms, actually, that showed that uh, given earthworms exposed to glyphosate produced a neurological disorder that resembled... Um, they, somehow they could tell it was something similar to Parkinson's disease, some kind of neurological yeah, you know, degradation you that related to your hand, Paul, Parkinson's. Listen, that was I, the I, only evidence I could find that sort of connected it in that way from right, the research I, I hope I'm not being disrespectful, but I, I mean... <laughs> earthworms and people. <laughs> maybe I'm being disrespectful, but I don't mean to. So. But... Um, so that's amazing. Now, I've heard that glyphosate is related to Parkinson's. I mean, when I go... Oh, yes, that's true, because in fact, uh, people, certainly Parkinsonian people are told to avoid um, environmental toxins, organophosphates, and, and um, organophosphates, I think, are hooked to Parkinson's, other right. organophosphates. Because I had, you know, um, in my books, I described the list of the, of the specific diseases that are associated with Roundup or glyphosate. And Parkinson's is always there. Yeah. So I uh, now I understand. More. Now this might be the, that the, might be another paper. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, all right. So we'll be done with Parkinson's. Yep. Let's move on. All right. So Parkinson's people get off of, of <laughs> get on organic.